Hola. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. My name is Miss Kiff. I'm a digital marketing executive, van lifer, social entrepreneur, DJ producer, and the list keeps growing. <laughs> Hi, welcome to another video. My name is Tasha aka Miss Curve and if this is your first time on my channel, welcome and if you're already subscribed, welcome back. You may know that I have started to, I'm living in my van full time and I just wanted to do this monthly video which is about how much did I spend living in my van and um you know moving forward just to show you how much it is for living in a van how much does it cost and maybe you can if you're thinking about doing it you can literally reflect on my results and see if it's something that you'd like to try in the future okay so i want to talk about the the lifestyle so each van life uh, before i get into the the the, the details now now some of you may have already seen this content and the figures are on my TikTok or my Instagram and you can follow those both down below. But basically, my lifestyle is a little bit different. Um, some van lifers I've seen before um, still have full-time jobs and like this is one chick, she's still a flight host um, and other people travel around the world, be creative, blah, 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 blah. So my one is i basically am working part-time as a digital marketing executive um and this is at a hotel and i am studying in a master's finishing my dissertation i've literally got two months to finish i also um work for myself which is freelance with um youtube blogging and things like that but also I like I work twice a week in Cardiff or after work I go to the, the studio which is a startup a co-working space where I um, work a lot. In terms of expenses there's obviously I travel back and forth because I don't prefer to live in the city. I live in outside the city because that's just what i prefer at the moment and my van is still going under mechanics and i am basically based a lot in the city so therefore a lot of my expenses are now out and about this is reflected more in july's but i just want to tell you um just a little bit of a back like bit of background as to what i'm doing so that you can know for this video next video and the video moving forward i bought my van on the 17th of june and it it's a voxel vivaro um so this is obviously only two weeks of june so it doesn't reflect my full june but it starts in june so i have to give you june's details and what i'll do is i'll calculate from the 17th of june to the 17th of july so that you can 16th of july so you can see a full month or the 17th of july a full month of what i've spent and then we'll do july as a month moving on moving on basically that's how the series is going to go okay so i bought my van for 1400 okay then on diesel i've spent 34 pound 32 which is not too bad i'm still using that petrol now and it's july uh, £38.77 on food. I know for sure this is this is quite good for those two weeks. To forecast like the £30 for two weeks, like £15 a week. But I've gone over because I don't have a fridge, basically. Amazon Van Bolt. So the Van Bolt cost me £71.84. Um, Superdrug, which is my self-care. My face masks. I love to pamper myself. is £3.58. Um, traveling to work is 35 pound and 10 pence driving license i had to renew my license cost me 14 pound and then the van insurance cost me 65 pound 45 so that's a total of 263 pound and six pence um and i have including my van that's 1663 pounds and six pence but if you take away the van bold it's just under um, 
pounds basically i'll put the right figure in the edit i've spent on actually living in the van which is pretty decent um i do forecast for the next few months for it to be um i'm trying to track my spending i'm trying to be a bit more responsible and it's really me doing this video shows me a, a lot of accountability because um i've always been very bad with my money and this is a great way for me to be 30 flirty and thriving baby you know what i mean so yeah hope you've liked this video hope it gives you a bit more insight and this will change as the few months go on because of my lifestyle number one and i'm currently i'm not traveling a lot because i'm still doing my like i'm building up the mechanics and things like that but mechanics and stuff still cost money so we'll see over the next few months okay if you like this video give it a thumbs up please do subscribe i will see you in the next video